Hey YouTubers, it's your girl Shannon from Tesla and Chill and it has been a hot second since our last video was released. So I just wanted to do a quick catch up with you guys just to say hi, we're still alive. Um, we've been a little bit busy just doing some traveling, having some family come in and visit us. Um, and speaking of crazy, one of the latest things that has happened since our last video is Tesla stock has been like going off the charts, but in a good way. So let's take a hot second, let's look at what Tesla stock has done just in the past few days. Even just today, it's been like doing really well. So this is good news for me. I hope it's good news for you. I hope you have not been one of the people who have been trying to short Tesla. Um, that has not been working out really well for those shorters. Uh, but let's take a look here real quick. You'll see what I mean. We'll take just a look at what's been happening today and then what's happened the past week here or the past, I guess, 52 weeks in the past year. But you can see it's February 11th. Tesla stock closed at 774.38. Um, I'm doing pretty well in that, I think. I wish I got in back when, um, if you recall, I talked to one of like the employees when we did the Tesla tour and he got into Tesla's stock when it was like $19 a share. Um, and he was able to buy a Tesla like outright with some of that money. So that is like super good. And I'm thinking he probably held on to some of his stock. Um, so he's definitely making more bank off of that. Um, but take a look here at these numbers because it is so crazy. You can see the 52 week high was 968.99. And if we compare that with the 52 week low of 176.99, that is insane. So Tesla stock has been going crazy. It's making Elon billions of dollars. And if you remember probably like, was it maybe a year or two years ago? It was a little while ago, Elon just made a tweet where he wanted to like privatize Tesla. And I think he made a comment about going back to like making shares $420 a piece. Um, and I don't even think that even like got past the tweeting stage. But I'm guessing right now he's probably really happy he didn't do that because he's made so much money off of this. But that's just one of the things that's been happening like in the past few days. Tesla, of course, has released a few changes on the car and we'll probably go over that in some future videos. We're gonna be dropping some pretty soon where we do that I'm feeling lucky because we haven't really done that ourselves. So we wanna be able to share that with you. We're gonna make a few modifications to our Tesla. So we wanna share that with you too because you are a part of our Tesla family. Um, also, Elon has released a song. I don't know if you've heard of it lately, but it's been on his Twitter. It's like an EDM song where he even does the vocals. I took a listen to it. Um, I won't lie, it's not really my favorite. I think it's probably like a good jam to listen to if it's like background music and you're not really paying attention to it. Um, yeah, so not really my favorite song. I'm hoping maybe his future songs will be a little bit better, but honestly, like my own PO, my personal opinion, is that Elon doesn't really need to focus much on music when he's already got his hands full making the Cybertruck, making the Model Y. Um, they're definitely ramping up production. They've got the Gigafactory in China. Hopefully the coronavirus won't make like a huge impact on all of this. Um, I hope all those people get better, but I also hope it doesn't prevent more Teslas from coming out on the market. But here in America, they are expecting the Model Y to be released sometime in March, which is like way ahead of schedule for Tesla. I mean, typically, let's be honest, you know Elon, he typically runs a little bit behind schedule. When he promises something, we usually really expect something to come out like a few weeks later, maybe even a few months later. So the fact that the Model Y might actually be delivered in March, that's a really big deal. So Tesla is definitely doing well in a lot of areas, even worldwide, which we love to hear. Um, but those are just a few of the things that has happened since our last video. I know there's so much to cover, but we're gonna have some more videos coming out for you soon. So thank you for your patience. Thanks for watching and we'll catch you next time.